Hi guys, now you are going to study about power triangle concept. Okay, what is the use of power triangle? Power triangle is that which shows the relation between apparent power, real power and reactive power. Apparent power, real power and reactive power. Okay, let us consider the impedance triangle like this. Okay, this is the impedance triangle. Uh, this is R, resistance R and this one is let us say X. Uh, this is R, this one is X and the resultant this is let us say Z. Z is equal to root over R square plus X square. Okay. And uh, this is the impedance angle theta. Okay. So, this is an Impedance, basic impedance triangle. Okay. So, similarly, the power triangle is also like that. Let us say power triangle. Power triangle. Okay. So, it results in this is active power or real power. Real power. This is reactive power. Reactive power and this one is apparent power. Real power, reactive power and apparent power. This is power angle. Okay. Already in the previous videos we have derived that. What is apparent power? We have derived apparent power. Apparent power is equal to VRMS into IRMS. Am I correct or not? VRMS into IRMS. Similarly, Real power is equal to real power is equal to VRMS IRMS cos theta. Okay, and reactive power is equal to reactive power is also derived. Reactive power which is IRMS IRMS sin theta. Simply for our uh, convenience let us consider this vi it is vi cos theta vi cos theta and this one is vi sin theta. Okay vi cos theta and vi sin theta. Let us consider the apparent power uh, represent the apparent power with the letter s. Yes. We use it to represent the apparent power with letter s. Yes. And a real power with the letter P and reactive power with the letter Q. Okay. So now, so real power, real power is P, reactive power is Q, and apparent power is S. Okay. So from that, we can write S is equal to root over P square plus. Q square or S is an apparent power which is equal to S is equal to P plus JQ. S is equal to P plus JQ. Okay. So, what is the real power? Real power P is equal to VI cos theta. Okay. VI cos theta. What are its units? Its units are watts. Real power is measured in terms of watts. Okay, and reactive power Q is equal to Vi sin theta, Vi sin theta, which is measured in volt ampere reactive. Volt ampere reactive. And apparent power S is equal to V into I, V into I, which is volt amperes. 
volt amperes see here what is s s is equal to vi vi volt amperes it units are volt amperes and active power this is the active power p is measured in terms of watts and this is q so this is a what is active power active power p is equal to vi cos theta and reactive power q is equal to vi sin theta vi sin theta and its units are volt ampere reactive volt ampere reactive active power is measured in terms of watts okay by now uh, by using this power triangle if any two terms are known if if you know about active power and reactive power we can measure apparent power if you know apparent power and active power we can measure reactive power see here this is uh, this theta is impedance angle and this theta is a power angle theta is power angle okay so in general this impedance angle and power angle both are one and the same impedance angle and power angle power angle these two are equal okay so this is about power triangle thank you